the no TTIP times. What is TTIP? Well, TTIP is the Transatlantic Treaty, and it would bring American-style healthcare to England if we allowed it to go through. It's not just our health that they're going to be attacking, it will be all services, because it entitles them to make maximum profit with minimum input to the service. Hello, my name's Jasmine, they call me Min, so I'm a member of the National Health Action Party, and I'd like to tell you why I first joined them. Last year on the, uh, I think it was the, the beginning of April, which would have been the NHS's birthday, the NHS Action Party carried a coffin through London and we joined them down at Parliament Square just to see what was going on. And I liked everything that they said about defending our NHS and so hence that's why we support them. So I came along today to hear them speak. And uh, we've had some strikes in the last few weeks, including by NHS workers. It's not just been NHS workers, there's been job centre staff and so on. But this week on today, we've got the Society of Radiographers out. What's the National Health Action Party's policy on, on those strikes? Well, fully supportive of them. Because if we don't stand and support the actual workers within the system, it will fall apart. We have to support them from within and protect them. And, uh, why, in short, do you think that uh, working class people, members of the labour movement, unions or members of the anti-austerity movement, when the general election comes in a few months' time, why should they vote for the National Health Action Party? Well, because I think if they vote for anybody else, their vote is just being split. We need to sound, uh, send a resounding message that we care about our National Health Service. So if we all voted National Health Action Party, if you have a member standing in your area, I think that would be a good message to send. Yeah. Since March 2009, wages have dropped by, on average, £1,750 a year for an individual and person. So, so does the National Health Action Party, what does it say about wages and, and that kind of stuff? Well, that they think that, that wages should be raised to a more sustainable level for people to live on. So not a minimum wage, but a genuine living wage. Because it's, the wages have been eroded, as you said, but the prices haven't been eroded in the shops. They've just continued to go up and up. And not to mention fuel bills. So they talk about cheap energy, but it's never going to come to us. So I think with the National Health Action Party, even though they stand under the banner of the National Health, they're going to cover so much more than just health. Hey, how can people find out more about the National Health Action Party? Well, you could Google NHA or you could go on contact at nhap.org or press at nhap.org or you can go on uh, Facebook page which is the National Health Action Party and here we are.